In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up image SEO using the All-in-One SEO plugin. Welcome to All-in-One SEO. We make SEO easy with our powerful WordPress SEO plugin. Let's get started. Remembering to set image alt text or title attributes is something that's very easy to forget when you're adding new content to your website. But we can use All-in-One SEO's image SEO to help us with this. From the WordPress dashboard, if you head on over to the All-in-One SEO menu and click on Search Appearance, and then when the search appearance page loads, click on the image SEO tab up top. If this is your first time using this feature, you're gonna to have to enable it by clicking the big green button that says activate image SEO. This is a plus feature, so you're gonna to have to have a plus plan or above with all-in-one SEO. And then on the image SEO tab here, the first thing we see is this area talking about attachments. So there's some advice from us saying we recommend redirecting attachment URLs back to the attachment since the default WordPress attachment pages have little SEO value. You can disable that if you want. You can redirect it back to the attachment parent, but I'm gonna take the advice and leave it at the default as the attachment. Underneath that, there's a section called image SEO, and this is where we're gonna set up automatic title attributes and automatic alt tag attributes. So for the title here, I'm gonna use the image title that's already in there. I'm gonna put in a separator, and then I'm going to use my site title. There's tons of options here. You can click the view all tags button or you can click any of these drop downs and you see all the other options that are available. So this is saying I want to use the image title, which is basically the file name of the image minus any extension. So if the image was called t-shirt.jpg, it would just put in t-shirt. We're going to use a separator and then we're going to use the site title. Underneath that, we have an option to strip punctuation for title attributes. So if you have punctuation in your titles and you don't want it there, you can enable this and strip those out. I'm gonna leave it disabled for now. I don't think I have a lot of punctuation in there. And then for the alt tag, it's got the image alt tag in here. I'm gonna remove that and then show you one more shortcut. If you put in a hashtag here, you can also get all of those options that you were getting from viewing all tags. And I'm gonna use the image title. This time I'm not gonna use a separator and the site titles. Again, we have the same option to strip the punctuation out. I'll enable it on this one. We're going to click the big blue button that says Save Changes, and we're done. So I'm back on my dashboard now. I'm just going to pull up this post I have called Men's Basketball Shoes. I just wanted to bring this page up because this represents a fairly typical workflow for a lot of people. I was rushing to build this page for another demo video, and if we click on this image here, we can see that I forgot to put alt text in here for the image. This is a very typical thing that happens. You're excited about your new content you get building and you forget to put in alt text. So if I pull up the live page here and I scroll down, I know I have no alt text on this image. I did manually type in a caption, red basketball shoes, but I know I didn't put in a title either. So if I hover over the image, sure enough, it comes up with shoe one, which was the file name minus the extension. The separator is the dash and then AIO SEO demo is the name of this demonstration website. If I right click on the image and choose inspect, I can inspect the image with Google and see that the title of the image is in fact shoe1-aio seo demo and the alt text is shoe1. Obviously I need to use more descriptive file names if I'm gonna use this method but everything we set up here in the image SEO settings worked exactly as it should have, and it put in a title attribute and alt text information without me having to manually do it. So this tool is a game changer as far as time savings, especially if you have a site already that has lots of images and your only option would be to go through and manually add all these alt text. You can literally just set this up in five minutes and have alt text and title tags for every single image on your site now. So that's how to set up image SEO on your WordPress website. If you click on this next video right here, I'll show you how to set up social media integration. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tips and tricks on how to use our easy and powerful WordPress SEO plugin, All-in-One SEO.